Good day, everyone. It's Jonathan Stacy. I hope your Saturday is off to a great start. It's been a busy Saturday here at the local station as we've been tracking Hurricane Harvey. It moved ashore last night at just about 30 miles to the north of Corpus Christi in the town of Rockport. That storm has moved inland, but it is a slow mover, only moving at about six miles per hour to the northwest. And as we have told you over the past couple of days, the track is rather uncertain. Really through the weekend going into the early parts of next week, we do not know where that storm is going to go. Most of the models just have it kind of lingering in portions of central and eastern Texas and the problem with that is it will dump heavy amounts of rainfall over the area for two or three days. So we're looking up towards 20 to 35 inches of rain anywhere from Houston to the south. The storm could make a northward track and move closer to Louisiana over the next few days. Once again, we'll keep an eye on it and you can join us both online at newsforjets.com and on air for continuing coverage of Hurricane Harvey. Looking at our local forecast for today, we're only getting up to a high of 87 degrees. We have mostly cloudy skies, more sunshine this morning, However, rain showers are in the forecast for this afternoon. It looks like the more heavier amounts of rain will be to the north of I-10, while we'll see more scattered showers to the south of I-10. Tomorrow, that's kind of reversed. But you can see rain chances for tomorrow are at 60%, and our highs stay in the mid to upper 80s for the next few days. Tropical moisture does move in by the end of next week, raising our rain chances and raising our temperatures. I hope you have a wonderful Saturday.